So I thought he looked unreal for the juniors, and then they said, we'll see you later, hopefully. And I thought that meant for the overall. We were watching the overall. The first guy came on, the second guy, the third guy came on. And yeah, I was like, fuck, he's not going to be on there. And he, no one else stepped on, which was such a shame because ugh, he looked absolutely insane. And if he was on that stage, then who knows? I think he probably would have had a very good chance. Hey guys, so uh, we are on the way to my client Cameron's show, Two Bros Pro Events. He's competing in juniors, 22 years old. Uh, if you follow him on Instagram, you would have definitely seen him. But yeah, a very big day for him, and we're gonna go and film some bits. And just because his physique is just unbelievably good. Like, he's all the way in now and looks phenomenal, and I really wanna make sure that we can display his physique to you guys and show you, you guys the, the work that he's actually put in over the last, this whole prep and then also before, in terms of putting on this muscle tissue as well. So, we, this morning, uh, he's looking amazing, right where we want him. We have played the condition game for sure this time round. We not to say that we aren't pushing cards, but we just we are playing safe because his showing last year was one where it was the other way round. He was very full, big, but not in shape. And this whole you know, I've, I've been friends with Cameron for many years, and I saw him step on stage then, and we had a conversation, and I said to him, "Look, like you've got so much potential here." And if we get you in shape this time, now if we work together and I get you in shape, it would be so cool to see your physique in that, you know, at its true potential. So we started working together in November last year and immediately did a pre-prep diet, got him into a very good position. We didn't have enough, quite enough time to get food as high as we'd like um, to have like a perfect, perfect prep. But we still got food high after his pre-prep diet and then we went into prep and due to having that good amount of time not like i wouldn't say we had crazy amounts of time but we you know we started working together giving us enough time to make sure that he could have a decent starting point for prep and really ensuring that he came in with the condition that we want which is just completely pills you know no more body fat on him and that's what we've done so really excited to show you guys today but yeah i'm really excited for him because this year was just about mainly making a statement showing people what his true potential is you know where where he can actually be and then moving on from that with a very productive off season after this where we have very big goals you know when you see him you'll agree that he is uh he's got the potential to go all the way really and we're thinking you know two on two in the future yeah i believe cameron's level today he should be winning that junior class there's probably only like a handful of people in the uk right now at his age with his level of muscularity so realistically because it's a regional I, I really believe he'll be winning today we'll see you never know who can turn up that's bodybuilding you you never know who can turn up and that's always why i think it's a bit funny when i see people on instagram saying like oh i'm coming for first place i always believe in being confident like that but you know just just i just don't like flaunt it on instagram i believe cameron should win today and he probably will but we will see because you never know who's going to be on stage but we've done the main thing which is bringing a physique that really shows his potential and we couldn't have done anything more that is the biggest thing about bodybuilding being at your best and that's what he is today so yeah it's going to be a really good day today i'm just so excited you know we've been working together like i said for a while now and i just can't wait to see him in person as well because so i trained with him and i had a brief look but yeah his physique is that level of freakiness that is so cool to see in person so yeah i'm really excited and hopefully you guys really enjoy watching him on stage today so yeah we'll see you in there Yeah. <laughs> Last one he was out, he was in my belly. <laughs> yeah. 
kota bu. So lean now, like you can just sit in the pose calm. Yeah, side, side try. section tight the shapes just unreal I look at the glutes everything it all came together perfectly as well I feel like I can always hold on that I beat him so <laughs> you beat him? I beat him last year <laughs> that's mad that, that no offence that, that is mad oh, no, that, that shows condition though that shows what condition does yeah yeah 100% so, I wouldn't have beaten you this year <laughs> right, we only started to work on together in October, and you just got your head down. You did what you needed to do, which is just trust your coach. Put the, 
the get go as well. So you can do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and what your coach says, and your body reacts to what your coach says. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And yeah, now we know we've got a good relationship. It's going to be a crazy off season, man. Yeah, well done. Sweet as my boy. So, thank you guys for watching. This has been a great day. So happy to see Cameron take the first place in juniors. This whole prep for Cameron was just about seeing his physique at its best, at its true potential. And that's what we've done today, you know. I really don't think there could have been anything else to do for his physique. You know, he was all the way in, like dry, full, so much detail. And yeah, if we compare to last year, like it's just such an improvement. And that is the that is the biggest thing about bodybuilding. You know, you're you're trying to improve upon your last uh, last time you displayed your physique, and that's what you've done. But that's exactly what he's done. Uh, it was a, unfortunately he uh, didn't he wasn't invited to the overall. We didn't really know. I didn't know as well. Like that two bros do the overall based off just like the open classes. So because he was a junior, not in middleweights or heavyweights or whatever, it meant that he would, he wouldn't be allowed to go on to the overall. And I think if he did, you know, I think he probably would have won. It would have been close, but I think he would have won. Especially when I saw what they went for, which was conditioning, because of the guy that won, it makes me think, well, then Cameron probably would have won. Uh, but it doesn't matter. Who cares? It's just one title and he's, he's won the junior class. And... We got to think about that long-term goal. That's that's a plan. We're thinking about where can we get him in a couple of years' time because being 22 years old and you've seen his physique, the potential is literally insane. So we're going to get into an off-season. There's no point wasting time dieting for shows and titles that aren't going to get you to that you know the pinnacle of bodybuilding. You know Cameron, he wants to go all the way to the pinnacle of bodybuilding. You know he looks up to people like Jay Cutler. So we're getting him to the Olympia. That's going to happen. It will take some time, but that's that's the plan. So next time he steps on stage, he needs to be getting an IFBB Pro card. Now I think right now it would be close, but he needs a little bit more. He does need more muscle. He's almost there, but he does need more muscle to get that Pro card. And something that Cameron's very good at clearly is putting on muscle. So we're going to get to that. It's going to be one to two years out. We'll see then after after the first year. We'll see and then start considering when, when he will step on stage. But I also said to, said to Cameron, and he agrees, it's like, when he gets that pro card, you know, we want him to be at a very, very high level. Because a lot of the time, you, you turn pro, and then you have to take another two years out, and then, you, then you're doing another off-season to get to the Olympia or win a pro show. Uh, so, yeah, one step at a time, obviously, but very big goals in mind for someone that is only 22 with that physique. It's just absolutely insane. So thank you for tuning in, guys. Hopefully this has been really entertaining, different style of video, something that's sort of, you know, showing my coaching side of things. You know, a lot of it is just me as an athlete training in the gym. So please like and subscribe. We'll get more videos sort of like this as well uh, to come in the future. But yeah, we'll see you again very soon.